TJ, Holmes and Amy Robach discuss their positions about getting married. TJ, Holmes and Amy Robach are fully committed to their romance. Even though they aren't quite ready to walk down the aisle, the former hosts of GMA3, What You Need to Know revealed that although they have talked about getting married, they aren't positive if they would marry in the end. On the April 21st episode of their podcast, Amy and TJ, TJ, commented, We haven't decided whether or not we are going to officially get married. Amy stated, We haven't figured the marriage thing out yet. Not that they haven't discussed their future plans together, either. I think we're still deciding about just what that level of commitment is, Amy said. But mentally, emotionally, we've absolutely agreed to commit to each other. She went on, I want to be with you for the rest of my life. I have said this to you, and I think you've said it to me as well. We're going to move in together. A life mate is what I want. I want someone to accompany me. I enjoy staying up late and waking up with you. For Amy, a life partner holds equal significance to a married couple. She mentioned Kurt Russell and Goldie Hawn as the quintessential example of a couple who, although never married, had been together for 40 years because they wake up and they choose to be together. There's no legal binding document that says they have to be together. TJ, 46, and Amy, 51, have been open about the consequences of their relationship, which began when Amy was going through a divorce from her ex-husband Andrew Shu and TJ, was still legally married to Marilee Feebig, but claimed to be divorced. But Amy and TJ thought they had something unique from the beginning.